Yes, sir. Yes, sir. Yes, sir. First order of the day, $11, three miles curbside. Nah, I'm good. What we got? 18 for five, shop and deliver all day long. Yes, sir. Welcome back to the channel, guys. I'm your boy, FDA Dash and Trader. Can you make a thousand dollars with Walmart Spark? That's the question. Well, it turns out you can, but you gotta know the right way to do it. So I've been grinding my butt off for these first two earnings week. Right, today is Tuesday, by the way, and I I haven't had earnings like this on Walmart Spark in a long time. So Monday, I made one hundred and ninety-five dollars and fifty-five cents, and that's not counting anything extra. That's just Trip earnings, no, that is counting some extra. That's incentive, trip earnings, and tips. But today, we've knocked it out of the park. 250 on a Tuesday with Walmart Spark. I can't even remember the last time I made over 120 bucks on a Tuesday. Tuesday is notoriously slow on Walmart Spark, but I did something different today. Something that I've been meaning to do, but had the right opportunity. Well, if you watch yesterday's video, you'll see that you know, we've been having some trouble with people using multiple accounts, taking up all the good orders. And even in some of the border states, they're having trouble with people scamming the system and flooding the market and not, you know, leaving any orders for the normal Walmart Spark drive as well. I said, you know what? I need to do something different because curbside take too long to pick up. You know, certain Walmarts, you may not get good orders. I went to a whole different Walmart and I exclusively did shopping orders today. And I was able to break my Tuesday record of 120 bucks. Shattered it out the park, guys. $250. Now, if you ask me, that's great money. But here's the thing, though. My highest earning days are Thursday, Friday, Saturday, and Sunday. So with me being at this point on a Tuesday, there's probably going to be incentives starting tomorrow all the way through Sunday. I'm definitely hitting that thousand dollars this week. I'm not letting nothing stop me. Cause what you gotta realize is I'm determined, I'm motivated, and I need this money too. I got bills to pay. You know, I'm sitting here, I got the other car out the shop, good to go there. You know, I got a couple more things I wanna buy, some accessories to get it all hooked up, some stuff that I don't wanna transfer from this vehicle to the other one. It's neither here nor there. The main thing is I gotta get out and I gotta hit it hard. And the way I'm doing it is, instead of going out in four hour increments, I'm hitting it as long as the order's coming in good. When they stop coming in good and I sense that a slow period is incoming, then I kind of taper back a little bit. But for right now, we are doing great. As you can see right here, $937 last week. And for this week, we already sitting at 388. But that's not even the best part. They sending me an offer right now. I just got a round robin. But before I look at robin, take a look at this. Three. Let me go ahead. Look, 388 confirmed and over a hundred dollars in tips that I'm waiting to clear. That means I'm pretty much at 500 bucks in the first two days already, guys. Let's go ahead and have a look at this round robin because I might take it if it's good. We got $37.85 for eight miles. This is literally the biggest order I have seen all day. And it's an $8 tip on there. I'm definitely taking that. $37. I'm already at 250 for the day. You see that? This order right here gonna put me at 280 on the day. I'm definitely taking that. Now, it doesn't matter if you got Walmart Spark available to you, DoorDash, Uber Eats, Instacart. Instacart probably jamming right now. You need to be taking advantage of these shopping because ain't no way I would have been able to make this money in the amount of time you see the kind of orders we getting. Ain't no way that would have happened if I, if I wasn't focusing exclusively own the shop and deliver orders because this is what you got to realize first of all we should only be delivering to tipping customers that's the first thing right there and for two when you're doing shopping orders particularly orders that require the customer to have some sort of service like a Insta instacart account or a walmart plus account or even a doordash account you know these are customers that's already willing to pay a premium for a premium service right you gonna encounter customers that are more willing to throw you some tips on there and be generous. This order right here that I just picked up, it ain't number 30 items on this thing. And it's going eight miles, don't get me wrong. But Walmart don't, don't pay for mileage. Walmart pay for the order. They, they paying you a base pay no matter how much the order is and no matter how far away. So what that tells me is that this customer 
that I'm dealing with right here on this order, this customer is a great customer. Why? Because first of all, this order is paying me almost five to one miles to money ratio and the item count does not exceed the order value. So we good to go. The order value is 37 for me. You know, it might be valued more than that, but it's 37 bucks for me. That's how much I'm gonna make. That means that I don't wanna see more than 37 items on this order. And it ain't. That's how you know when you're getting good orders when it comes to them shopping delivers. Now look, I'm gonna slide up in here and get this little order done. Might want it tonight. But it's gonna put me at eight and a half hours, 280 bucks. And it's gonna put me closer to that $1,000 goal for the week. Now, once we hit that $1,000 goal, we ramping it up. I'm going for 1,200 the next week. Might see if I can do 12 or 13, or uh, uh, 13 or 14 on the week after that. But we gotta first get our feet wet. We gotta hit that 1,000 and we gotta put ourselves in the best position to do that. Which means on the first earning day, the second earning day, you gotta hit it hard. You gotta change up your game, do something different so that you can maximize even when things start to change. Even when you got people using multiple accounts, flooding the market, you're doing different type of orders you don't normally do. You got to get that money. You got to pay them bills. Look, we all left them W-2, so we don't got to worry about no job, no boss. You got to be your boss, and you got to make sure you're motivated and out there getting that money. I'm about to slide up in here real quick. Boy, it is cold out there. The temperature is 34 degrees out there, guys. It is, like, super cold right now. I just got that thing shopped. Took me like 20 minutes because ain't nobody in Walmart no more. I'm just running around like a chicken with his head cut off, but I'm knocking them out. So I'm like, I'm happy. I'm chilling. Now, I'm trying to enter this address into the GPS, but it's giving me problems. Because when I hit it, it's not, it is not sending me to the right address. Like, what is going on? This order said it was going eight miles away. And when I type this address into the GPS, so when I hit navigate, it sent me to a similar named address with a different zip code so then i enter this zip code i enter the address like manually and nothing's popping up so we got an issue right here we have a issue and then it goes even deeper i type in the zip code that they provided right here and it's not popping up like what is going on so what do i do in this situation because even when i type that in it's still giving me the wrong address like what is going on i'm finna have to figure this out blood this is gonna be my last order of the night i'm finna be at 280 dollars with one app let's get it if you enjoyed this video you found a little motivation inspiration you enjoy watching me freeze my butt off do me a favor hit that like and that subscribe button for your boy and i'll catch you in the next one the end the night off we got the address situation figured out they had the wrong zip code in the app but i was able to figure out get the right zip code and it actually let me check in when i got there Got it dropped off. No, 128 miles, eight and a half hours. We did three hundred and twenty dollars. We did three hundred dollars and three cents in in orders, but we got a twenty dollar incentive for four trips. They they popped on like a last minute incentive just for today. You do four trips between three p.m. and ten p.m. and I was out that time anyways. Extra twenty bucks. So we did three hundred and twenty dollars, guys, in eight and a half hours. Let's go. Average hourly rate of $37.65 for the full eight and a half hours. This is how you run it up, guys. Now, look, this put us in the best position that we ever been in on the Walmart Spark app when it comes to earnings on the week. So I was sitting at $285 before that last order. Tips rolled through, incentive rolled through, got that banger order, $320 in one day for the week. For the week, guys, we already sitting at $450. In confirmed tip earnings and confirmed trip earnings, guys, 450 confirmed already on day two. And we got 86 bucks in unconfirmed tips. So let's just look. 450 plus 86. We already sitting at 536 bucks in the first two days. And I promise you, 90% of the orders I didn't did been shopping orders. This is probably gonna be my new way to go. Now, again, it's time specific. It's not gonna always be an influx of shopping orders in your market when it comes to these apps. But when it is, you need to maximize. Now, I'm pretty much, I'm halfway to the goal already. We hitting a thousand this week. We making that happen. And to give you guys a quick update, on the 21st of January, we will be doing our 13,000 subscriber giveaway. I know I'm late, I got bills to pay, but guess what? That's the day we get that YouTube money. 
So make sure you hit that like and that subscribe button so I can run that check up and maybe give away a couple more dollars. As of right now, the, the, the giveaway amount is going to be 200 What increment we do that in, that's still to be determined. But $200 will be given away. And we're going to be doing some other things too, so stay tuned. January 21st is the giveaway day. We running it up. $1,000 challenge. Walmart Spark. Can it be done? Yes, it can because I'm the fastest dasher alive. Fastest shopper alive too. I'll catch you in the next one.